This is your one and only Firespark81 with your daily dose of video goodness, and welcome back to the Valheim Hardcore Let's Play series. So, uh, I got the course. I'll show you a clip here. Here's me getting the course. Look at that. Yeah, one core, another core. That's the first time I found a dungeon like that where the cores weren't just like all in a room. There's just like one here and then one there. Really weird. Anyway, if you've found dungeons like that, let me know, because I'm interested in how the procedural generation works in this game. I have yet to see one like that. They've always just been in a room in varying amounts. So, we have our cores. We need to make the, the kiln, and we need to farm a buttload of wood. So, I need 20 stone. Do we have 20 stone? There's some stone in there. There's a bunch of stone in there. Okay, we're good on that. Okay, so that's all we need, and we're just going to slam this down uh, yeah that looks like a great spot okay so now we just need to process a bunch of wood i want to get enough going that uh, i can just have all the coal that i'm going to need for a short period of time and then i'll go find cores later i just don't have time to hunt down all of the cores all at one time so we're just gonna fill that bad boy i think that is in the radius of my circle here yeah it is okay we're good so here's the deal I think I can take the, well, I know I can take the Elder right now. We need the seeds. I only have one, and I'm 90% sure I need a boat to get to him. So while that wood processes, we're going to throw the rest of this wood in here. And I know it's raining and kind of crappy, but I want to go over and I'll get a proper storage system at some point when I have time to deal with a proper storage system. I do not have that time right now. We need to get these bosses done, and I need to... I'm worried. My biggest concern is the bone mass. Yes, I have a, a simple, easy way to cheese the bone mass, but the problem is, is he's going to be, it's going to get to a point where I won't be able to deal enough damage to, to kill him before he can kill me eventually. I need to be able to kill him relatively quickly, or I need to do the old cheaty method where, or I should say cheesy method where I go farm a bunch of arrows first and use frost arrows on him and I don't want to do that. I want to use the new melee method. So I need to do it in a timely manner, which means I want to do it before we hit stage two. I'd like to hit kill the elder before we hit stage one. Let's see here. Can we get to the elder? Okay, so we're, I don't think we're going to get to him from here. This, this doesn't go all the way across, does it? No, it does not. What? Hey, boars. Uh, you're all trash boars. Why do you gotta be trash boars? We really need, like, a, a two-star boar would be freaking awesome. Or even a one-star boar would be fantastic. That way I can farm all that good meat. Okay, so let's go down the shore just a little bit here. I'm pretty sure this is all just shoreline. I'm sure it's shore? Yeah. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna double check, though. But I'm 90% sure we're gonna have to build a boat. Oh, maybe not. And while we're waiting for my stamina regen so I can go over here, and we're, we're slowly swimming over here and checking this out, I gotta say something. I got so many freaking comments on the last video that was like, hurdy her 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 you don't use the power, but yet you need it, or you're complaining about stamina while you're trying to fight said troll. Listen, I'm not using my power as a crutch for combat because then I'll get used to having it when I'm in combat and that'll get me killed. Second of all, I never think about the power and my thing with the power is, is when I do think about the power, I'm like, well, what if I need it and I don't have it because it's on that stupid long cooldown that they're on. So then if I use it whenever I feel like using it, then I'm like, well, if then if I need it, I'm not going to have it because it could be on cooldown. And so then I just wait. And then when I need it, I think, well, do I really need it? If I blow it now, I won't have it if I really need it. And then I just never end up using it and I just play the game without it. I will use it though if I'm going on a long run. If I know I'm going on a long run and, and it's going to take me a while to get to an area, I will use it. But 99% of the time, I don't use it for that reason because I feel like I'm going to need it at some point and I won't have it because it'll be on cooldown. And then it just, you know, it just keeps happening over and over again. And also, I don't like to use it in combat because it's a crush. It also does no good for the stamina that is being used when I'm drawing the bow, which is where most of my stamina during a troll fight gets spent because technically you don't really need to run from a troll. You need to sprint and spurts when they go to attack, you sprint away. Other than that, you just kind of walk so that 
that they attack and then you move when they're attacking. So, yeah, hurdy her her comments with your, oh, complaints about stamina. That's why. Oh, I think I may have found a way across here. Maybe? Maybe this connects to the other landmass over there? Okay, we're going to do a little swimming. Swimming always terrifies me because I'm afraid I'm going to run out of stamina and get stuck in the water and die. This is all relatively low, though. It might actually be connected, and we might just be able to do this. If we can do this, we're going to go back. We're going to get the arrows, and then I know where to get the seeds. There's a couple spawners over there. I'm just going to destroy the spawners because I don't really care. I saw plenty of spawners in that forest, and I'll just get the, the other seeds that we need. Um. Oh, it might actually... Hold up, hold up. Look over here. Over here. Can we go from where we're at here to over here and then connect to the landmass? I think we can. Can we eat another mushroom here? That is a very long swim, though. Although, that could be connected over on the other side. I'm going to run back and check. Oh, yeah. We're on the other landmass. We can get to him from here. Okay. That's all I needed. We're headed back. Because it's right over there. We're already over here. I just got to get past all these idiots. There was a group of them here that I just aggroed. Um, we should be all right. I think I can dodge all of them relatively easily. I mean, they're chucking rocks at me, but it's whatever. Okay, so we're just going to ignore them. We're going to run back. We're going to grab the seeds that we need. We're going to make a bunch of arrows. And then we're just going to head back over here because we have a straight... Well, not a straight path, but we have a path uh, to the Elder. And I don't need to make a boat, which means I don't need to worry about bronze right now. We're going to need the to continue to tech up after the fact. But I want to get the Elder out of the way. And then we can tech up a little bit and then we'll be good to go. Oh, 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 we got a troll here. Can we get him stuck? No, he does not get stuck. Oh, God. Swim. Swim. Okay. All right. We're all right. We're all right. Uh, we're not all right. We're all right. We're all right. <laughs> I'm cold and I'm wet. We're not fighting this troll. I'm running away. We're just running away. Slowly. We're slowly running away. Okay. Let's book it. Okay, it is the morning of day nine, so I have one full day and night to do this before I have to increase the difficulty. And for those of you who do not, do not know, uh, when I talk about that, I'm just going to use the command players and then set the player count to two, then three, then so on and so on and so on. And that artificially increases the difficulty of the game because things scale depending on how many players are online. Okay, so let's drop off all of this stuff. That took forever to get back, but I think it was worth it because it's going to save us time in the long run. We don't have to worry about processing or mining ore. All right, here's our first spawner. I'm going to see... I'm going to farm it just a little bit to see if I can maybe get one of the seeds uh, from one of the brutes. Before I destroy the spawner. Yeah, like right here we have a brute. You know what? Get lit on fire. Well, maybe not. Maybe don't get lit on fire. You get lit on fire. Oh, oh, the brute hurts. Dude, seriously, really? Really? I know, I know a bunch of you are like, just make a shield, but I don't have room for a shield right now. And, uh, I'll make one eventually when I transition to how I'm fighting. Oh, so now we got two brutes. Okay, well, I guess that's kind of good. You know what? I have an idea. There we go. Problem solved. Stop dodging my arrows, bro. How many arrows do I have? 20? Okay. Oh, and he dropped a seed. So that should be it, right? I forget how many I need. Three? Four? I don't know. We'll kill a couple. Well, if I can hit them. Hitting them, hitting them helps, usually. Usually when you're fighting stuff, you want to actually be able to, to hit it. Okay, another one down. He did not drop a seed. But that's fine. I think... 
Can I actually get up this? Yeah, 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 yeah. This might actually be where we want to hang out. I should have brought more arrows. But I may also be able to just kill enough of them that uh, I can just make arrows here, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, you know what? We're not going to waste the arrows. Let's go down here. Let's just fight these idiots. Wow, they hit when you... They hurt when you get into a group of them. And they're like chucking crap at you and hitting you. Yeah, get wrecked with fire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come get you some more. You want some? Yeah, you do. Get you some fire action. Oh, you know what? I should just use the hammer. With them grouped up like that. Although, it's always fun watching them burn. That's always a good time, too. Yeah, you know what? I think I'm just going to go over here and destroy this thing. Yeah, get wrecked. I'm not going to wait on any more brutes. We're going to go over. I think I need three, right? I can't freaking remember, and I don't have time to look right now. Is that another brute over there? Did, did another one spawn? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We actually had another one spawn. How many arrows do I have? Four. There's no way. Um, get out of my way, bro. So let's kite them away. Come on, idiots. Come on, idiots. Here, idiot, 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 idiot. All right, there we go. Let's kite them over here. And then we'll just run up here and... Yeah, there we go. Okay. And then we'll just run through there. Oh, I only got one seed out of that. That freaking sucks. Maybe this guy will give me another one. Can we hammer time? Yeah. Yeah, I think this will work. I just got to be careful. Uh-oh, we're running out of, uh, you know what? You know what we can do? I always forget that I can do this. Come back! Come back and fight me! No? No, you don't want to come back and fight me? You want to chuck stones? Like a little punk? Yeah, you take that. You want some too? Yeah, you do. Now, where'd that brute go? Get over here, brute. No. Oh, 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 he did get to hit me. I was going to be like, you don't get to hit me, but apparently he did. Yeah. Yeah, get you some of that. Come back. Come back over here. Don't you want to fight me when you can't hit me? Look at him run. He's like, nope. I don't want none of this, bro. Yeah, you do. Almost got him. There we go. And now this other one, I'll just axe. And he didn't drop a seed. All that, and he didn't drop a seed. I don't have time for this. All right, we're running back to the base. I got five minutes before I can pop the freaking power again. See, that's why I never want to use it. Because now I'd love to have it right now, and I don't have it right now. Okay, I was right. It is three ancient seeds. I had to go look it up real quick because it's been a while since I fought the Elder, and I couldn't freaking remember. You know, you forget little things like that. I also want to grab all of this deer hide and we're gonna make what i have the rag pants so i want some actual leather pants yeah leather pants now we can equip those so we at least have a tiny bit of armor and can take one or two hits now let's craft a bunch of fire arrows okay i have 100 fire arrows hopefully that should be good i'm gonna craft a couple of wood arrows just to be on the safe side, well, I'm going to use those for everything else that I fight along the way there if I fight anything else. I'm going to try not to fight anything. I'm going to try to just make a straight run for it and ignore everything. Should we make the leather helmet? It's only six deer hide. I'm going to make it too. The more armor we can have, the better. Usually, I don't wear the leather helmets and stuff like that, but I feel like we're going to need it because he's probably going to hit us relatively hard this early on. Okay, so we're going to drop all of that into there. That, nope, that's not where that goes. 
I'm gonna sort through this inventory real quick and then we're gonna head over there. Okay, so it looks like the troll is still over here, but I think I can easily just bypass him. Hopefully. Hopefully we can just ignore him. Don't see me, Mr. Troll. Don't see me. Just go on about doing troll things. Does he see me? We need stamina before we can get across the water here. No, we're good. We're good. We just got to make this swim. We'll make this swim and then uh, we'll head straight for the elder's spawn thing. Yeah, troll has no clue. Okay, well, we made it here and we got a bunch of idiots that we're going to have to deal with before we can fight this guy. So that's always fun. Which means I'm also probably going to have to wear down my bow a little bit too, which is... Not something I was hoping to do too much of. Oh, swing and a miss. I was also letting my food run down so we could get a nice fresh food buff right when we get ready to fight. And of course we have a bunch of idiots attacking us and I hope we don't continuously have them bugging me during the fight because that's gonna freaking suck. I mean, we can hop up here and kill them easily enough, but I can't be doing that during the fight when I have Mr. Elderface shooting vines at me constantly. I really, I gotta get the buff. Can we get the buff here? Can I sit down right here? Our buff ran out. Oh, we're running out of time. It's gonna be very iffy. So here's the thing. If it's mid-fight, I can't stop to, to run the command. So if the fight's still going on come day, it's just gonna have to go on with, with him at whatever level he's at. And I seriously, I gotta get something up to, I gotta get something up to repair. Oh crap, it's day 10. Well, I guess we're fighting him with an extra person. All right, so let's repair everything. Ah, oh, God, I was really, 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 really hoping to not have to do this now. That freaking sucks. I just needed to repair before we could start the fight because the bow was already highly damaged. Okay, so let's sit down. Let's run the command. So we go, I'm a cheater, players, two. I don't know if I need to leave the I'm a cheater on or not. I'm going to leave it active just in case. I don't know if it's a situation where if I turn it off, if it changes that command or not. So I think we'll just leave it active. Okay, uh, let's let's just do this before we, we're running out of time. The time is it just goes so quick. Okay, so let's grab those, put those there. Should we, should we make a hold of cheese? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna. If we can't do it like this, then we just don't do it. Then we just die. Screw it. Uh, let's eat some honey. Make sure our food is all up. Okay, where's he spawning at? So we should be able to do this relatively easily if we just stay behind. We just stay behind the thing. And then just be careful of his vines. That's all I have to do. Yeah, I know, you're angry. I know, you're angry. Though, of course, I won't be talking much during this fight.
no! Oh no! Well, that was a short series. Oh my god! I knew I had to kill him before day 10! There's just- Oh man! It would have been fine if I had had the troll armor at this point. It would have been fine. But I didn't. And, and, and two players, I could have taken him with with it being fictitious, fictitious two players. Like him being, having all those buffs. If I'd had the troll armor, I could have taken those hits. Oh man, I should have cheesed it. I should have freaking cheesed it. But I wanted to try it. Not cheesing it. Man, that makes me so mad. That makes me so mad. Well, I, uh, I hope you all enjoyed this series. Let me know what you think I should do for the next series down in the comments section. If you enjoyed this video, consider hitting the subscribe button, the notification bell, all that good stuff so you can be notified when I upload other Valheim content. Um, here, as promised, let's, uh, let's do this on camera. Man, that freaking sucks. That really sucks. So, uh, start game. Here's our character. Bye-bye, character. And, uh, here's our world. If you, if anybody wants that seed, there's the seed. Capital We gonna die. And, uh, remove the world. Yes. Okay, well, uh, that sucks. That, that really sucks. <laughs> I was really hoping to go further with this series, but uh, it happens. All right. Well, that is going to wrap it up for this episode. If you like what you saw, consider hitting that sub button. I want to give a big thank you to my patrons for making this episode possible. Y'all are absolutely amazing people. If you would like to join my League Crow Patreon supporters, please check out the link in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. If you're shy, you don't like to comment, just hit that thumbs up button and show your support. Until next time, thanks for watching.